From Tampa Bay Screening News Leader, brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com, this is ABC Action News. I'm Dee O'Reilly. Keep your umbrella handy today. Greg D says expect pop up showers throughout the day. We'll check in with him coming up. But first, though, I do want to get your ABC Action News headlines. John John Chuck let a judge know that he will not take the stand in his murder trial. The state plans to call more witnesses before closing arguments. John Chuck is facing the possibility of life in prison or in a mental institute for throwing his daughter off a bridge to her death in 2015. The Parkland Shooting Commission, headed by Pinellas County Sheriff Bob Galtieri, returns to work today, and the commission wants to know if their recommendations are being implemented to make schools safer. The topics to be discussed include whether districts are reporting false data about on-campus crime and if they are complying with the law that requires armed officers at every school. The Lightning's quest for the cup just about to begin. Game one is at Emily Arena tomorrow night. Downtown Tampa was all lit up in blue in support of the Bolts. The Lightning want to get you pumped up for the playoffs. The team is hosting a free outdoor screening of Disney's The Mighty Ducks tonight at 7 at Sparkman Wharf. Thunderbug and the Lightning girls will be there with some cool Bolt swag to give away. Also, we encourage you to download the free ABC Action News app right now so that you don't miss a minute of the playoff action. Once you have the app, be sure to watch our ABC Action News special quest for the cup. It's tomorrow at 630. We'll be live from Thunder Alley with all the excitement and exclusive interviews with the players. You'll see it only on our streaming apps on Roku, Amazon Fire TV and Apple TV. Ballerina, you must have seen her. That's Tampa's Raquel Trinidad singing a duet of Elton John's Tiny Dancer with Lovely Band on American Idol. The judges thought it was her best performance so far, but unfortunately, she was still eliminated. You can watch the remaining 14 Idol hopeful sing live for the first time on Sunday night. Greg, she's fantastic. I'm so sad that she got eliminated. I'm sure she'll have other opportunities after a performance like that. Uh, best uh, wishes for her. Hello, everybody. As we go through the rest of today, mainly cloudy skies could see a pop up shower or thunderstorm this afternoon as another piece of our storm system moves by. It'll be more scattered. That is widespread as it was earlier this morning. Temperatures will stay in the 70s with cloudy skies and there's going to be a south breeze that'll be gusty at times. Best way to stay ahead of some of these pop up showers. Check out Titan Doppler radar by downloading the Storm Shield app. One of Broadway's most acclaimed new musicals of the past five years is coming to the Straz. Dear Evan Hansen opens tonight. There are eight performances through Sunday, and you can enter to win two $25 tickets through an online lottery at LuckySeat.com. Well, you can get news updates all day long on the ABC Action News mobile app. We will send you breaking news alerts right to your phone. This ABC Action News update is brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com. Drivers always avoid distractions while driving and focus on the road because safety doesn't happen by accident.